Hi guys and welcome to the first episode of Let's Develop, um, a series that I've just started where you'll join me in the film developing process. This will be the first time I've ever developed film so hopefully we can learn with each other and I hope you enjoy the series. So in the first episode we will be developing Fomapan 200 in Cine Stills DF96 monobath solution. So this um, I thought would be a really good start um, for film development. There's no need to mix chemicals or anything like that. It's just one shot, one go. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is check that it is up to temperature. Okay, so it's sitting just below 19 degrees at the minute so luckily I have a nice water bath sitting ready to go so we'll just put that in while we get the rest of the film ready. Okay so the next step is to get your film and um, which is a 35 millimeter film into your Patterson tank. So your Patterson tank is um, light sealed so this is the lid, and um, you also it also comes with this little um, uh, like a dipstick, but we can't see that in the because it's black against here, um, and it also comes with a reel. This one came with two, so you can actually develop two rolls of thirty-five millimeter or one roll of one twenty. So I have this all sitting out on my. Um, uh, changing bag, which means I don't need a dark room, so very handy, um, and my scissors. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to place all of this inside the changing bag. There we go. Now. Um, when I get a spare roll of film that I'll sacrifice, I'll show you how to do this outside of the changing bag. But um, until then, I'll show you um, how we get on in a couple of minutes. So, that was a little bit tricky. Um, not too bad for first time though we'll see at the end of this um, how it turned out because if, uh, I hope it didn't bunch up in there um, but we'll see so what have we got left the the start of the row and the canister so you can see how I had to open it up because I didn't leave the the tail Okay guys, so we are in the bathroom and I'm just going to check the temperature on this now. We're not quite there yet. So we'll give it another couple of minutes. Okay, actually, so while we're waiting for um, the Mono bath to come to temperature. I'm actually going to pre-wash the film. <laughs> I've just watched a lot of other film photography YouTubers um, who seem to like um, pre-washing their film, so I thought I'd give that a go. But I'm just going to um, get the temperature up to 24 degrees, so it matches the development temperature. Gonna fill it up. And just going to agitate for a minute. And 
we'll do this two or three times. Okay. Okay, so we're at 24 degrees now, and I'm going to pour it in my developer. There we go. So we should be covered. I'll just fill the tank nearly. for the first 30 seconds okay so that's four minutes up I'm just going to try and pour this back in so we can reuse it so if you're looking at my head Instructions say to pour it at to wash it under running water for five minutes or fill and empty the tank at least ten times. So let's just get our water up to room temperature. Room temperature, so we're just gonna fill and empty this ten times. I'm just going to add a uh, one mil of photo flow to it. The photo flow will help the drying process and hopefully not leave any streaks across the film. So here is our Kodak photo flow. And we only need one mil. Now I've heard stories of people using far too much of this and their negatives coming out very foggy. So we'll try not to let that happen. So I'm just using the little old ibuprofen syringe. I'm just putting that straight into the tank. I'm just going to swirl that around for a bit. Just uh, wait one minute. And we'll just pour this in. Oh wow! Haha, <laughs> we do have images. So here we go guys, we have images. Um, I'm really happy, um, well with how <laughs> that we actually got something on the the film. Um, whether or not that translates to um, good images on the um, scanner or what was yet to see. Um, so this is my makeshift hanger <laughs> here, um, just in the bathroom. And what I did was, um, and sorry, um, I had to switch to the phone here just because the camera battery died. Um, but what I did was, um, when I hung them up, I just cleaned my hands and just took two fingers and slowly dragged down the film to remove any excess water. And um, yeah, that's all there is to it, to the Cine Still model bath. Um, well, um, on another episode, I'll show you the scans and you can let me know what you think. Um, if you're interested in funding more of these episodes, guys, um, 
and they will get better. Um, my Patreon link is in the description below and I'm running a, um, a special offer at the minute if you sign up um, before the 11th of December you'll get a free A4 landscape print and, um, and also guys, um, thanks for watching and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you.